The elements of effective leadership strategies are decision making, priority setting, resources and marketing, coordinate program staffing, external relations and discrepancy analysis. Major administrative decisions require adequate decision making procedures and expertise to meet new challenge. The strategies of priority setting may appear more political than rational because of its nature of recognizing competing expectations and values. I'm going to briefly explain each one of the leadership strategies. First strategy, decision making. Major administrative decisions require adequate decision making procedure and expertise to meet new challenges. Next, I will put the reference in the description section below. Mark suggests the three aspects of decision making that contribute to affect leadership strategies that is, belief, human as in the internal, interpersonal relations, and organizational as in the bureaucratic and political dynamic that influence the decision making process and reflect in bargaining and compromise. Next strategy is priority setting. The strategies of priority setting may appear more political than rational because of its nature of recognizing competing expectations and values and emphasize consensus building with all that implies in the form of bargaining and compromise. People include in the priority setting strategies are the policy makers, resource people and the participants themselves. Next strategy, resources. Resources are related to financial decision and require attention to accounting concepts. Non-financial ideas also include such as purposes, circumstances, program development, and value judgment. Marketing. Marketing which includes marketing concepts such as encouraging contributions, value responsiveness, and marketing audit. For more information on leadership strategies and techniques, watch my previous video on leadership strategies and techniques part 1 from the video link above. Next, strategies coordinated programs. So what are the differences between an effective program administrator and a new program manager? The coordinated programs focus on program origins, orientation of resource, persons, planning committee, supervision, and situational differences. Staffing. Staffing are among the most influential on results because of the people who work for an agency affect the process of making most of the decision. For more information on staffing, watch my previous videos on leadership strategies and techniques part 2 from the video link above. My next strategy is external relations. The decision-making strategies effectively involve people from the parent organization, regulatory organizations, and the larger society. My final one strategy is discrepancy analysis. Other than whatever strategies mentioned before, for example, decision-making, priority setting, etc., are fall into this category called discrepancy analysis. Finally, thank you so much for your participation, watching, and listening. Until next time.